Hey man, what's up? <laughs> I just watched Sweeney Todd, and it's like, it's like the like the sequel to Edward Scissorhands or something, because he's like he's like all grown up, and like he he had like plastic surgery done on his hands, and he like he's like you know what I'm gonna go and start my life career in like this sooty old. London landscape straight up built by <laughs> Nightmare Before Christmas guy. <laughs> and like, so he goes and he like opens up like a barber shop and like, he's like, you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to be unorthodox and like cut hair with like, with like straight razors and stuff. <laughs> right? Like, like Mr. Blonde <laughs> style razors. <laughs> okay. And like Hans Gruber like conspired with the uh, freaking Peter Pettigrew and they like kill his wife and like like it's dark you know like too dark for me to pay attention to like what the actual storyline was right that's how dark it was and everybody's like singing and like it totally doesn't feel like you should be singing at this time freaking Bellatrix Lestrange and she like owns a Popeye shop and then she's like making Popeyes <laughs> I think Bellatrix Lestrange is hotter when she's like polyjuiced by Hermione it's like making Popeyes but I guess they're like no good it, but like she's still like doing it you know she's like I still want to I still want to make Popeyes he finally like lures freaking Snape into his barber chair and he's like, I'm totally gonna make sure that you pay for being such a dick. And like they start like chopping people up and like putting them into the pies, you know. And this movie is it's all bad guys. Like <laughs> the whole movie. There's there's no good guys. <laughs> Which is awesome. Okay, so like. And like, like they like cook them in an oven. Like I fell I fell asleep because like the singing like made me happy, you know? But and you know me, man, I like a happy ending. Okay. But I also like pot pies. And here's the thing, man. I would not eat a pot pie. If on the ingredients box it said human, okay, I'd be like, no, I'm not going to eat this, right? And, like, I feel like you could solve a lot of the world's, like, hunger problems if you, like, like, could convince people to eat, like, pests and stuff, you know? But, like, like if you took rats and, like, they were, like, overrunning, like, a city and, like, you were able to, like, make them into, like, a delicious pot pie but, like, weren't, didn't have to tell people then I feel like, I feel like that would, you know, solve something. But you know how it is, man. You solve one thing and it just causes something else. So that's why I don't ever pick a cause. That way, I never pick the wrong cause. <laughs> All right, man. Hey, listen, I got to go. Uh, I love you. Uh, uh, don't forget to call your mom, man. Oh, hey, thanks for the card. Bye.